And so I'm actually gonna take this one off in front of you. I just wanted to find everything. I just put it on a napkin. And it comes off. It's like a, a lot of it comes off. It's, very, it's, it's oily, it's supposed to be oily. To take off permanent makeup. I used to be a professional makeup artist. I know, right? <laughs> uh, I don't get into that again. Because um, they gave us classes in this meta this skincare line called Metamorphosis. It's like somebody, oh, skincare line, this company called Metamorphosis that was started by Danielle Nafti. And she's an Amway. And they taught us to be professional makeup artists. I took classes and passed most of them. I just needed to pass one more. Um, I got the airbrush machine. I have like a suitcase, literally a suitcase, like the ones that you take on the plane with you, full of makeup. Um, I used to do a lot of brides and I did um, some films for some students. This is Glamour. And uh, some film. I did makeup for some actors for a film for some students. Look, I got a mustache myself. A lot of people are really into this, these dark colors. I'm not a big fan of them, but when I see them on people, I'm like, oh my God, you look so good. And then I see them on me. Oh yeah, so the other one wasn't patchy in the inside lip. I think maybe I just didn't put enough on. Give it the stain. I think that was all time to move up. Yeah. I'm like, that's not my lip. Of course, it's the dark one that's giving me issues. Because I got on my seat. God. We are having technical difficulties right now. Um, Because it's the one that's going to stain the ugliest. If you don't put it, oh, because I put it in my inside of my lip. So the dark ones always, it's the dark or the red ones? But you have to kind of get them perfect. Come on. Come on. I feel like if you, if you press like, like that, bad because in the video the heart the hard candy video they top so i'm gonna do what the video tells me to do because it's clearly their video they know what they're talking about right this is really weird it's really strange to look at myself with a dark lipstick i don't know what you guys will think if you want to leave comments of the colors and what you think i i'm not used to seeing myself like this because it's not something that i would do hmm it's very vampy. And I guess maybe for Halloween or something, I now have a color I could use. Because <laughs> I would never, ever, ever, ever go this dark. Um, I'm more of like a ooh, classic. I think it went into the, the dip there. Um, makeup girl. Very classic. Classic everything. Like I'm a Ralph Lauren preppy chick. And every so often I have these moments where like, oh, wear two buns and UFO pants and like a tank top and rave. You know, like every so often. Um, so I do while out every now and then, but not as much because I have to work and pay bills. But if I didn't, if this book thing that I, because I'm writing a book. Oh, I'm writing a book. And maybe I'll put the link on here when I actually publish it. But my name is Maya Perdomo and I'm writing a book on, I'm not telling you what, you'll see when you see it. Uh, but I'm writing a bunch of books, not just one. So I actually finished one. I'm editing it. I wrote another book on self-love. It's a six-week workshop that I'm doing. Um, and it's a workbook. And then you get one or two uh, one-hour sessions with me every week for the progress. So like while you're doing the exercises, you can call me. And at the end of the week, we'll have a discussion with the group. So one hour is personal and the other hour is group. You don't have to do the group, but you can. Um... And it's just teaching people how to love themselves and get back into loving and nurturing yourself because 
like so many times we get lost and you're like loving everybody else and you're doing all this stuff for everybody else and you neglect yourself. Obviously, if you're watching a makeup video, you're not neglecting yourself because you're doing makeup, but let's do it. Oh, that's patchy. I didn't let it, I didn't let it dry enough. I didn't let it dry enough. Hmm. Mm. You can see the glitter. <sighs> Trying to dry my lips. Feels so yucky. I would maybe wear this for a costume. Because I have a habit of licking my lips. And then that's not good. So I'm trying to dry my lips out. <laughs> the weird things girls do. Is that an answer? Trying to dry my lips out. <laughs> okay. I already did it. This is just to see if I can keep the, the bottom one in. Probably gonna give this to my sister too. See? I want my lips again. I think this is my problem. Yeah, no. This one's really patchy. It could just be that I need to let it dry more. But now you guys see whether it's good or not. It's the one my friend had. She was in the mirror for a while. And I think it's maybe because that's what happened to her too. That it kept rubbing off. But when it stays on. It's beautiful. Because she was wearing it all night. And by her wearing it. It made me want to buy this. So I did. I bought four. Um, I got them on eBay. They were $3 each. With $3.50 shipping. I know they're like $6 on Walmart. And $6 at Hard Candy. Um... I mean, it's pretty if it stays on, but it probably didn't stay on because, I don't know, maybe it was talking or whatever. I'm going to try and do it again. Um, but yeah, so, but then each additional one is only 50 cents shipping. So the first one is $3.50 shipping and then every other one was 50 cents shipping. So then they're only $3.50, which are cheaper than where you get them anywhere else. But the first one was actually six fifty. Everyone after that is three fifty. If that makes sense, because it's three dollars plus fifty cents, so it ends up saving you money if you buy it on eBay, um, and then they all come together. 